Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Andrew Can, and together we can game, here to bring you my brand new project, Can Play Shovel Knight. Now I have heard a lot about Shovel Knight, Shovel Knight came out in 2014 and it was originally a kickstarted project and a lot of people praise it as one of the best platformers of recent years. Now a lot of people have wanted to see more variety on my channel, a lot of people have been saying they miss seeing some platformers, be it 2D or 3D, 2D such as the Lion King LP I did when I first started my channel, which I'll put a card to, and things like Spyro and Crash Bandicoot, so a lot of people also said but they want to see more new games on my channel, so I thought what better way than Shovel Knight, so let's get started. Now, I've never played Shovel Knight, so this will be another blind one, uh, why don't we call it WKG for We Can Game, and it won't take as long to type as my full name. Alright, so I do want to stress, I am playing this on PC, but I'm using my Xbox controller. Yes, I would like to choose this profile. Let us get started. Long ago, the lands were untamed and roamed by legendary adventurers. Of all heroes, none shone brighter than Shovel Knight and Shield Knight. But their travels together ended at the Tower of Fate, when a cursed amulet wrought a terrible magic. When Shovel Knight awoke, the tower has sealed and Shield Knight was gone. His spirit broken, a grieving Shovel Knight went into a life of solitude. Aww. But without champions, the land was seized by a vile power, the Enchantress, and her order of no quarter. Okay, that's some pretty good art. Now, the tower is unsealed, and devastation looms. A new adventure is about to begin. Okay, so far it does a really good job getting you pumped. I love the art style. Strike the Earth. Awesome! I wonder if that's just tip or is that like a level name? Okay, trying to get the controls down. So B and X do that. A is to jump. Y doesn't seem to do anything. Ooh, lots of gems. Okay, so to do that. Oh, I thought that would have been a button combination, but all it is is you hit down on the keyboard. I'm noticing they're giving me jars too. And I'm, I wonder if every enemy drops default blue or do the gems change? I'm noticing they go in my gold counter in the top left of my screen. So, that's also important to note. To start off, I love how you can see the tower in the background. I just find that a nice little touch. And I wonder, I'm not sure if I will die if I go down here. Alright, we will see. Ah, uh, dang it. <laughs> okay, first death. Recover 90 gold. But I thought it was worth trying, because I didn't know if they did secrets like that, or if it was just immediate death, but that's uh, a little unfortunate. It kind of looks like there'd be something down there, I don't know. Maybe that was a very uh, rookie mistake, but I, was, I guess I was expecting it to kind of be like games I've played in the past, but I do find it pretty cool that it gives you time to recover your gold. A lot of games you just, you lose it and that's it, so. Good on you, Shovel Knight. Okay, there you go. Make our way through here. Won't make that mistake twice. I say, hopefully. <laughs> I like how there's little mounds of dirt you can shovel as well, because it's just so fitting. So I'm guessing, okay, a bubble is here. Makes sense. Helping we at, we go. So this, what is this? Oh, checkpoint, I wasn't really too sure. It looked like one, but it wasn't. Wow, I can actually jump out of the, that's kind of cool. And I love the art style. A lot of people miss this kind of 16-bit style, but they do it so well. And it's upgraded for uh, modern times, too. So it's retro in all the best ways. Now, I do not know too much, but I know this game has upgrades, and I wonder how those will come into effect. Oh, wow. Oh, wait. <laughs> Why would I even bother? Now I'm noticing it gives me boss health, but he doesn't have any health taken off. So is he not a boss? 
Also, we were given more life, and god, 845 gold. That's nice. Let's go down here. Wonder if... Oh, that's one way we could kind of juggle things. That was cool. So let's go down here, and I'm noticing in this first level, it's not having to teach us anything. It's just letting us discover it on our own. Which is nice. So it saves them time, and us time as well, because I don't like sitting through tutorials too much. And a lot of these platformers actually never had tutorials. The levels just kind of experience... You kind of... Oh god! Don't know what I was expecting to happen with those slime things, but as I was saying, a lot of the older platformers just kind of let the level explain itself and you figure it out as you went along. Okay. Now, I don't think I can jump on the spikes. It just doesn't make sense to me. Ooh, look here. See, I learned that earlier. And I'm using it here. So it, it's another game where if you learn things... You can use them later in the level, and I'm always a fan of that. What is this? Look like a music note. And I wonder if that's going to play importance. Aha! It's important to look around as well. So, I see, I could have missed that gold. All in all, it's doing really well to impress me. I'm enjoying Shovel Knight thus far. Uh, see, here is another one. Want to get that before uh, I miss the opportunity. Now, I do wonder if there will be ways they change it up, because I know a lot of games tend to do power-ups, so I'm wondering if they have a power-up system here. But, I guess we'll find out. I want to make sure I uh, explore all my options they give us, before I just go in here. I don't know what they have, and if there's anything secretive I needed to do, so... Oh, that's health, I'm guessing. That's really useful, though. Let's make it to the side of the stage. Another checkpoint. Now, I'm noticing that... I'm not sure how many checkpoints there are going to be, but... They kind of are reusing mechanics we've learned, which a lot of games will just get rid of them. I know it's still the first level, but still. And god, this music is great! And I am using my new recording software, so hopefully you'll be able to hear pretty well. But here's like another secret, well not really too secretive, but another area that has a place we can shovel. I think it wants us to go up to the ladder. In fact, I know that's what it wants us to do. Man, I just gotta be patient. It's been a while since I've done a platformer, and I'm not good enough to speedrun this game, so... Yeah, I'm going to just need to be patient. Alright, and there we go. Now, I know a lot of people have been able to 100% this their first run. I don't know if I will be able to do that, but it'd be nice if I could. Oh, God. Talk about... No mistakes. Got the second music note thing. I wonder how many of those are hidden in each stage, and I'm sure my viewers who are veterans in this game will inform me. And if not, it's okay, too. Let's go. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest, anytime there's a section where you can fail, I go in knowing I can fail, just hoping I don't. Wait, I'm gonna like, leave that there. Oh god. Unexpected... Skeleton. Okay. Holy crap, that too was unexpected. It just looked like something I could do. Carrot. So, I guess we're gonna climb up here because this is the new one. I'm happy I discovered that. 200. Damn. They have a lot of hidden stuff in this game, which I know I'm gonna love because I love exploring things like that. So, here's another check mark. Which, this is a really long first level, but I don't mind it too much. And again, I've learned that those pits tend not to have things like that, dang it. Oh, so it tells me how many checkpoints are in this, so that's good. I'm pretty sure...
that uh, this last one here is going to be the hardest one to... No, it wasn't too hard. But it is nice that they let you know how many uh, you have to face, how many checkpoints there are. So there are four checkpoints in this first level. This thing again, huh? And I just completely... Oh, wow. If I wanted to, I could just completely ignore him. But I kind of want his gold. I know he will drop. Dang it. Dang it. That was terrible planning on my part. And I bet a lot of you were like, make sure he's not over that edge. I wonder. Aha! Now, I don't know if he will redrop his gold, but man... I see what they're trying to make you do. I don't want him to die or fall right there, so... Come on. Really? Man. But what is that little red thing he keeps dropping? I was expecting the other one. Alright, come on. That red thing he keeps dropping. I don't know what that is and I kind of want to get it, so I'm sorry if I'm wasting time and I'm, I'm not sure if that's something that is worth collecting or if it's just life or something, but it might just be life. That was just life. Dang it. That was worth learning. Now, there's first exact platforming section there. Okay, now how do I go about doing this? Awesome. I am kind of disappointed in myself that I was I lost all that gold to that one enemy. But we'll make it up. Is this a Yeah, it is. Is this also? No. See, we we're making it up. We're making good time too, I believe. First, why do I feel like there's something over here? Because there is. That's why. Oh boy. How many... Yes! I love finding this stuff. I love games that will reward you for exploring. And this one has done a great job of doing just that. So it, it takes my curiosity and rewards me, and I love when any game does that, and not too many do nowadays. That was nice to discover. And I'm pretty sure we have a boss, because there's no... I knew you'd show your face sooner or later. The... Cerulean coward, I think that's how you pronounce it. Turn back, Shovel Knight, there's nothing here for you anymore. Stand aside, Black Knight. I have no quarrel with you. I must return to the Tower of Fate, which is beautifully displayed in the background there. Your time away has dulled your senses, can't you see? This entire valley has been conquered by the Enchantress and her invincible knights of the Order of No Quarter stand between you and the Tower. But none of that matters because anyone after the Enchantress has to go through me. Steal thy shovel! Oh, that maniacal laugh, and now we have the first legit boss fight. I can feel the music change, and I mean, oh boy. <laughs> Laughing at me. Whoa, 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 whoa. He has got a pattern, but I've noticed it. Boy, why are you laughing? You could be attacking. Just gonna miss this. I was doing pretty well and not taking any damage from this. Alright. 
I want to take him out now. There we go! That's what I'm talking about! <laughs> I love that little animation. Thrusting the sword up in the air, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Black Knight just runs. And we fade out. I guess this is a stat screen? Oh no. What is this? I love the art here. I think I think we went to sleep near the fire, and that's pretty cool. Is this our stats? Oh, that's sh it's Shield Knight. Catch her? Whoa, this is a dream kind of sequence. This is really cool. I wonder if they're going to have mini games in the forms of dreams, because that... That's something I've never seen before. And that's really cool. Oh. Well, what do I do here? I can... Feat accomplished, only you. Only you can put out forest fires. Oh my god, I love the achievements. I think they're gonna be puns. Well. Whoa. Saving. So I had the planes clear and I have the music note thingy. There's a village. What is what is this gonna do? This looks like Mario World 2 or Super Mario World 3. Halt! No weapons. We have enough to worry about lately without everyone swinging swords around. Oh, haha, that's no weapons. Just a shovel. You may enter. And don't forget, press up to talk to everyone. Oh. Cause no trouble, warrior. Okay, so I like you to look I like to look nice on my day off. That's cool. Here's a secret. In Pridamore, keep going left first is right. Hail, Traveler! I am but a simple bard, but I have a big problem. I've lost all my music sheets. My entire repertoire lays scattered across the lands. If you ever find a music sheet, return it to me and I shall reward you handsomely. Woo! You have two music sheets! Magnificent! Take 500 gold for each? No! Oh, that was just going to see what happens. Wonderful! Let's see. Oh, you found Strike the Earth. Ah! We're saying a trumpet, triplets, it's there. Anything you can render into pure magic? Now I have this music sheet, I can form it for you at any time. Just ask. Well, that's cool. I wonder what you say. I just love living in a village. It's the best. I, I, I guess. Ooh, you've got a pretty face. You should come visit often. Ah, uh, no, i rather uh, not. Let's see what you have to say. Gastrometer. Pottage and poultry, mutton and meat. Your maximum health will increase if you eat. Bring a meal ticket, I'll whip you up a feast. Gotician might have some now. Where's that sly beast? Oh my god, I love the rhyming. There's Gotician right here. Ah, decisions, decisions. Should I extend my magic or health? Or just eat a tin can? Why not buy a meal ticket and help my options? Yes. Uh, meal ticket. Yes. You ac feed accomplished. First purchase. Ah, decisions, decisions. Should I... Why not buy a meal ticket? Yes. I'm gonna keep this... While I do have... Enough... Ooh, you've got a pretty face. Oh, well, why am I... Woman? I do not have time for you, Molly. Ain't nobody got time for that. Guess I'm going to... Ah, I'll dazzle you. So I'm getting more life. So I think that's a pretty good first call. Yeah, more life is always useful. We could choose magic or life, but there's something down here, and I'm wondering what that is before I make any more... Who are you? Juice Maiden. Ah, new phase. Dancers, acolytes, witches, goats. Everyone's welcome in here. Ooh, that Spectre Knight. If someone could de defeat him, I would bestow upon them my greatest treasure. Depose King. Oh, woe is me. The king of nothing not to rule but my lone barstool. King Knight sits on Pritamore's throne. That gilded goon. He'll get his soon. Grandma Swamp. 
Double trouble, soil, and shovel. My third eye knows your useless infos. Excavado! The number of dig piles you've dug is seven. Aruma Spanzado, the amount of gold you collected is 5,849. Santo Rifatum, the number of times you've fallen in battle is two. The Parm Perpata, the total time you've spent adventuring is 1844. I magically see all your acts. Come back again for more useful. Thanks for helping me, kindly witch. I'm not a witch! That was pretty funny. So what's over here? What does she have? Sigh, I suppose peaceful solitude is too much to ask. Well, as long as I'm stranded here. Shall we pass the time with a little... I'll just need a... 500. Alright, I've conjured up some things, and you can hit them towards the targets for points, okay? Ooh. A game? This So this is a mini-game. Alright, how do I... Doesn't seem like I can really influence which direction they go too much. But I'm still new to this, so we will decide. I'll make a better call once I, uh... I'm noticing my best bet are the colored ones, like here. Because that seems to do the most damage compared to all of the others. I got 109 points. Ah, you got 109 points. Good job, I guess. Take this and come back if you get bored again. Oh, wait. I definitely uh, made my gold back. So, in theory, that's an endless amount of gold if you're good at that game. I think I can go this way, too. Yeah, I can. Let's talk. Ah, hey, Shovel Knight. I know things are tough, but don't throw it in the towel. Hello, fi fish friend. All hail the Truffle King. Bye. Truffle Chalice, a vessel for storing mythical Ictor. Done. Ooh, what do you have? Psst, hey, blue guy. You wouldn't believe the merchandise I got for you today. Why not have a look? Yeah, why not? Fishing Rod, Chaos Sphere. An orb boundless of combat potential, cast into a bit pit and wait for a bite. Yeah, I'll buy that. Fishing rod. Hold up and hit X. Cast into a pit and wait for a bite. Keep an eye out for a sparkling fishing spot. Yeah, I'll have a look. Let's look at the orb of chaos. An orb of boundless combat potential, give it a good throw. Okay. Uh, nothing you have that I'm interested in. So let's climb back up and out of here. Let's see what's this way. Now I could go there for more mana, but I don't see a reason for that. Are you really the Shovel Knight? Prove it by digging up this dirt. Wow, incredible! You really are Shovel Knight! Wow, Mistress Knight, Mr. Knight, nice stick. Come on, let's play. That's what I'm doing, isn't it? Fourth wall jokes. Fishing is easy, yet we can cast your line off in any pit and wait for the... And haul him up. Giving us some advice. Whoa, whoa. Woo, these buckets are heavy. Wonder if there's a... Oh, there is. That's how I get to my gear. Let's see what you say. Oh, you're the fisherman. So I can play with her hoop stick. That sounded way more sexual than wanted. Fishing is easy, okay. Ooh. I'm noticing a music note. How do I get to it? Suggesting I go this way. But I think that's going to be it for this episode. That's going to be it for today. Let me know. What do you think of Shovel Knight? What do you think of its art style? And what do you think of the townspeople? I really love the rhyming potion or health increaser and probably mage magic and mana increaser too that's going to be it for this episode it's going to be it for today thank you all so much for watching thank you all so much for your time and as always i hope you have a great day